welcome back to my channel i am going out to plant these babies let's turn the camera around let me, let me put it on my oh, one second look at the table oh my gosh so much pollen look at this like they said pollen this year is really high so even if you're not an allergy sufferer you're gonna be affected by pollen isn't that crazy but anyways down here I'm about to put my baby it's in the garden so new babies right so these are old lettuce heads I told you guys you can basically get a second use with your lettuce and these are the onions this is basically how what I do with them with water and then they grow out and I <clears throat> put them in soil onion and then garlic as well see this is going to go in my garden by my tomatoes gonna serve as a pest deterrent and then <clears throat> I tried two methods of like growing garlic so these I put in tissue paper wrapped it up wet tissue paper wrapped it up put it in a ziploc bag and put it, put it in like a dark area and it sprouted but I like this method better because as you can see the stem when you do it that way it's just green it's just white right versus the green stem so you get when you put it in water so that's what I noticed hey guys oh welcome back it's the next day I am in the school line I am waiting for my kids I have about 30 minutes so I'm gonna eat my lunch beep, beep, beep. Um, I pack lunch every day with me because I, I would spend my days outside of the house nowadays but um, my lunch I'm having basically let me open it up <laughs> as you can tell the smile on my face uh, okay so I am having ahi tuna, some cauliflower, roasted cauliflowers and roasted potatoes. I tried making ahi tuna on my own for the first time. I used to, when I used to live in the city, look at, look at that. Mm, when I used to live in New York, before I got my own stuff, I had this cool job. So we did like massive events, like events where like I would say like stars, Oprah will come in and all that stuff. So it was big events. Um, they used to make all kinds of delicacy, like ahi tuna, you know, beef, a steak, steak, um, but a bunch of steak potatoes, like good stuff. And they used to serve it, but at the end when they were done serving the guests, we would have a lot of food from the chefs, you know. Um, from the chefs, I forgot what they call the craft or the the shoving thing that they put the food in to keep it warm. The warmer, I guess. We would have a lot of food from that, and it was like I had a feel there. It was fun. So I ate ahi tuna then, but potatoes. <laughs> I ate ahi tuna then, and I was like, oh my gosh, I love this. But I don't know if I can make it. But it was herb cross it was really good so i tried making it at home and it was so good and it is so good i was like mm, i'm gonna make this more often it has a lot of uh, vitamins so i love it but anyways let me eat my lunch in peace and i get back to you guys i'm tired um yeah today was just like from one to nine um just basically house girl work so it's a house girl so it's basically house girl work from one end to night. Um, that includes laundry, folding, putting away laundry, swapping up winter clothes for summer clothes. And I cooked. Let me show you what I cooked. So I made, I made, this is my crayfish. I'm like sorting it out and I'm gonna grind it and put it in that jar. But I made, so this, this is different. This is called cassava leaf stew. This is Sierra Leone, Liberian, like all that stuff. So this is cassava leaf stew. You can eat it with um, rice. Ofe Ako, Nigerian Ofe Ako Banga stew, basically. So I don't have the real palm nut um, extract. So I use the canned one, but still somewhat similar. <laughs> and then jollof. And then uh, plantains, we had jollof rice, plantain, and um, avocado with some carrots for dinner. I had ofiaku, obviously, and rice. Not obviously, I had ofiaku and rice. But yeah, 
that's what I've been doing. I'll show you my garden tomorrow, I think. I have to show you my garden tomorrow. So, hey guys, I am actually taking my hair out. These braids have been pretty sweet. I love these braids. I, I have just as much cut off, but I've enjoyed these braids thoroughly. Like I've had it for like a month and basically seven weeks. And I don't want to take it out, but like the back area is, it's not, it doesn't look as good <laughs> anymore. It's like the front, at least I can gel it down on whatever, but the back was just, the middle part was just, yeah, it wasn't working anymore. But I love this place. I just, I love it. I'm thinking about doing <laughs> somewhat of the same hairstyle, maybe the short hair. Do I think the short one looks nice? I don't know, but. I think I'm gonna do a short hairstyle because it's summer, it's getting hot, and I want the long thing pull it on my hair. So I may, I may do short braids. We'll see. But yeah, gotta take my braids out. So my trellis is being built by moi. I have bamboo sticks. I have twine. I think I've had this for a long time, but I have this for like holding tomatoes together. I'm making my trellis. All my tomatoes are in soil, so I wanna build a support system so that you know when they start to grow I'll prune them and then also um, allow them to lean the um, trellis will just basically serve as a support system for them because they need it yeah there it goes I planted basil I bought some basil seedlings from the store so I planted some growing some from seeds over there but yeah in the garden as usual Okay guys, my trellis is done. Please excuse the freaking frogs. I don't know what's going on. Babies are crying, whatever, they're loud. But yeah, my trellis is done. These are going to be my support system for my tomatoes. Um, if I need to go higher, I might just add on more bamboo sticks higher, but I think that's enough. But yeah, that's my stand for my tomatoes. My support system for my tomatoes. Hey guys, so I am back on my walk, day one, after a couple of months of not taking my walks, but I'm back on my walks. Um, so I want to start implementing this again. You know, sometimes you start, stop, you fall off, you start again. The most important thing is that you start over again. Um, today is a packed day. It's mostly running errands for my kids. Yeah, start, yeah, start it, right? Um, so I'm going to start doing that. Um, thinking about enrolling my kids in a lot of sports, um, because, you know, my, my biggest, like, error about that is that, you know, you take them to sports, but then that means you have to actually be there. You have to take them, and that cuts in in your day. So I don't want to do that, but I have no choice. I'm going to do that. Let me finish this walk. Um, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. So let me end the vlog here, because it's really nothing to talk about but guys until my next video see you guys soon